Good Erev Shabbos to you. I hope you're all well. Happy Friday, everybody. So you've had a nice holiday? Had a lovely holiday. What about you? Great. That's great to be back. I uh, hope you all had a great holiday. Have you been away and enjoying the summer? Did you miss us? I'm sure they did. <laughs> Two weeks without this. Who, wow. could, who could manage? Well, we're back. We're back. And uh, Mazel Tov this week. Mazel Tov. Mazel Tov to all the Mazel Tovs we missed before. Yes, absolutely. Uh, Mazel Tov to Michelle and Jonathan Goldman on Daniel's Bar Mitzvah. Mazel Tov. Mazel Tov to Judith and David Friedman on the arrival of their grandson. Mazel Tov. Mazel Tov to anyone else who has a birthday, anniversary, or any other simple in the coming week. Mazel Tov. We wish a full shlema to anyone who's unwell. Shlema. We wish long life to Shirley Lerner on the sad passing of her sister, Myra Halfen. Oh, nice. And to Anthony Silverstein on the sad passing of his mother, and anyone else observing a yacht site in the coming week. We should all live. And shout outs this week. Shout outs, everyone who got A level and B tech results Woo-hoo. this week. Fantastic. Well done, everyone who got the results they wanted to, and those who didn't quite get what they wanted to. Don't worry, don't let those results define your life. You will find something. You'll be amazing. You are a star, even if you don't have an A star, you are a star anyway. Uh, and uh, to the lionesses. So, yes, go on, you're better at football than me. Yeah, they, well, Lionesses are into the Women's World Cup final, so good luck to my, them. My football no is coming home, we hope. So good luck to them. Okay, so this Shabbos, so um, sh- candle lighting in our community is at 7.30. Mincha followed by Kabbalah Shabbat and Mario at both Croxel and Yavna is at 7, 7 o'clock. El Street still on their summer break. Shabbos morning. Oh, uh, some of us are back. Shabbos, yes. Shabbos morning at main services at Croxdale and Yavna at 9.30. There's also Limud at 9.30 at Croxdale. In the afternoon at Croxdale, we'll be starting a brand new Suda Shlishit series with Shirim leading up to Rosh and Yom. It's coming, four weeks. I don't know what you're talking about. Four weeks, it's coming. Oh, it's right. time for you to start making the honey cake. Absolutely. It's well, coming. we must have done this for at least a year. <laughs> wow. Uh, and that's at seven minutes, at 7.45. At Yavna, it's at 7.35. Also followed by a Suda and Shir. And Mariv, Motsi Shabbos, when Shabbos ends, is at 9.07. 9 early. As I said, uh, um, I said the special Shir this coming in the next few, few weeks leading up to Rosh and Yom. Also, if you're not yet signed up to DHL, Data Halakha Live, to get some insights into key concepts and prayers of Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur, Rosh please Yom. sign up to Rosh and Yom. That's what you please sign up by sending an email to info at Wormwood Shul and you'll get a daily short idea from me. Uh, anything else? Um, how about a uh, little bit of Oh yes, a little bit of Why not? Um, so you remember that game, Musical Statues? I do, yes. I do. I'm quite competitive, so I'm not, yeah, I don't I'm sure. want to play now. Well, I'm not sure how we'll, you'll, be, you'll do it. So because you, you, know, start the, music, you have to dance around play. when the music was playing and then stand as still as possible like a statue. You have to freeze. Uh, and if you move, you're out. Oh, we're doing really well here. Uh, um, and if you stand perfectly still, then you are the winner. Obviously, you always are the winner. Now, when it comes to the statues of an idolatrous type, the Torah is not in favour of that whatsoever. You know, it's a game. To the extent, in fact, the Torah tells us that God hates statues. Now, noting how strongly this is condemned, Rav Moshe Feinstein and Sal understands this in a broader context as an indication to us not to be statues in our religious observance. You see, God doesn't want us to stand still in our level of knowledge and commitment. Instead, we have to be constantly growing in our understanding of Torah and our keeping of mitzvahs. Now, as we begin the month of Elul and prepare for a new Jewish year, we have to undertake to be as unstatue-like as possible and be ready and willing to keep moving closer to God all the time while the music is playing. Have a great Shabbos. Shabbat Shabbat Shalom. Shalom.